हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम ललिता एंड हार्टी वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल वी बैकर्स टुडे आई एम हेयर अगेन विद मैथ ओलम्पियाड चैप्टर टू पार्ट टू फॉर ग्रेड फाइव क्वेश्चन आर एक्सप्लेन इन वेरी सिंपल लैंग्वेज आई होप इट विल बी बेनिफिटेड टू यू वाइल डूइंग योर ओलम्पियाड प्रिपेरेशन लेट एस स्टार्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन वट मस्ट बी सब्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम वन मिलियन टू गेट एट लैख सिक्सटी नाइन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड लेट एस सी द सोल्यूशन वन मिलियन माइनस एट लैख सिक्सटी नाइन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड एंड यू विल गेट वन लैख थर्टी थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड वेर इज दैट ऑप्शन वन लैख थर्टी थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड दैट इज ऑप्शन इन डी so your option d is correct let us go to next question question number 12 the value of 20 times 5 plus 95 divided by 5 plus 12 let us see the solution according to badmas rule we have to do division first if we divide 95 by 5 you will get 90 then you have to multiply 20 by 5 it will be 100 so 20 times 5 is equal to 100 then 100 plus 19 plus 12 you will get 131 where is that option that is in option c so your option c is correct let us go to next question question number 13 the highest common factor of 42 And one sixty two is highest common factor means we have to find the HCF. S HCF by division method. So one sixty two should be divided by forty two. It will go three times. So one twenty six. What is remainder thirty six. Now we will take thirty six as divisor. And forty-two as dividend. How many times will it go? It will go one time. Remainder is six. Again, take six as divisor and thirty-six as dividend. Six six are thirty-six. So, what is your answer? Your HCF is six. And high that is called highest common factor. Where is that option? That is in option A. So option A is correct. Let us go to next question. Question number fourteen. The number of prime factors of twenty are. We have to see how many prime factors are there in twenty. So take twenty. Two is a prime number. We can divide twenty by two. Ten, but ten is not a prime number. Again, we have to divide two fives are ten. So we have got all prime numbers. So how many are there? One, two, three. So three prime numbers are there in number twenty. Where is that option? That option is D. So option D is correct. Let us go to next question. Question number fifteen. Find the estimated sum of two lakhs five thousand six hundred ninety three and three lakhs fifty six thousand eight hundred twenty four by rounding off the result of the nearest hundred. So first we have to add them. Four plus three, seven. Nine plus two, eleven. Carry one. Eight plus six, fourteen plus one, fifteen. Carry one. Six plus six, twelve. Carry one. Five plus one, six. Three plus two, five. So five lakh sixty two thousand five hundred seventeen. We have to round up. To the nearest hundred. So at hundred plus five is there. So it is less than five hundred fifty. So it will be five only. 
500. 5,62,500. Where is that option? That is in option B. So option B is correct. Let us go to next question. Question number 16. In a school, there are 704 decks to be placed in 22 classrooms. If the same number of decks are placed in each classroom, then how many decks will be there in each classroom? According to statement, we have to divide. So let us divide 704 by 22. How many times it will go? 3 times. 22 3s are 66. So the remainder 10 minus 6, 4. 6 minus 6, 0. Drop down 4. It is 44. 22 2s are 44. So 32. Where is that option? That is an option A. So option A is correct. Let us go to next question. Question number 17. The sum of third multiple of 3 and fifth multiple of 5 is divisible by which number? We have to find out. So third multiple of 3 is 9. Fifth multiple of 5 is 25 and sum 25 plus 9 is equal to 34. So it's divisible by 2 because this is even number and it can't be divided by 5, 3, even by 4 also it is divisible by 2. Where is that option? That is in option D. So option D is correct. Let us go to next sum. Question number 8. Which of the following could be solved using the sentence A minus 5? Option A. Ishan is 5 times as old as Sanjeet if A is Sanjeet's age in years. Times 5 times. It means we have to multiply. So that is that option is wrong. Option B, Tarun is 5 years younger than Annie. If A is Annie's age in years, then how old is Tarun? Here we can apply that A. Annie's age is 8 and Tarun is 5 years younger. So this can be used for this statement. A minus 5. So option B is correct. Let us go to next question. Question number 19. The quotient when 2,22,816 is divided by 24 is, what is the answer? If we divide 2,22,816 by 24, you will get 9,284. Let us try. by 24. It will go 9 times and 24 nines are 216. 12 minus 6, 6 here 0. Drop down 8 68 24 times 2 is 48 and your remainder will be 20. Drop down 1, so 201, 24 times 8 is 100, 8 fours are 32, 3 carry, 8 twos are 16 plus 3, 19. So, 11 minus 2, 9, because here we have borrowed from here. Drop down next number, that is 6. So 24, 4s are 96. So uh, option is 9284. Where is that? 9284. Option B. So option B is correct. Let us go to next question. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी मारुति मोटर्स प्रोड्यूस्ड वन लैख ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड नाइन्टी फाइव कार्स इन द ईयर टू थाउजेंड सेवन नाइन्टी एट थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड नाइन्टी फाइव कार्स इन द ईयर टू थाउजेंड एट एंड थ्री लैक्स फाइव थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड एटी नाइन कार्स इन द ईयर टू थाउजेंड नाइन वट वॉज द टोटल नंबर ऑफ कार्स प्रोड्यूस इन ऑल थ्री ईयर्स सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द स्टेटमेंट वी हैव टू एड वन टू सेवन सिक्स नाइन फाइव नाइन एट एट नाइन फाइव थ्री जीरो फाइव सेवन एट नाइन इफ यू विल एड दैम वी विल गेट फाइव प्लस फाइव टेन प्लस नाइन नाइनटीन कैरी वन नाइन प्लस वन टेन नाइनटीन नाइनटीन प्लस एट ट्वेंटी सेवन कैरी टू एट प्लस एट सिक्सटीन सिक्सटीन प्लस सेवन ट्वेंटी थ्री कैरी टू नाइन प्लस एट सेवनटीन प्लस फाइव ट्वेंटी टू कैरी टू फोर नाइन प्लस फोर थर्टीन कैरी वन टू थ्री प्लस फाइव सो फाइव थ्री टू थ्री सेवन नाइन फाइव थ्री टू थ्री सेवन नाइन वेर इज दैट ऑप्शन दैट इज एन ऑप्शन ए योर ऑप्शन ए इज करेक्ट थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग द वीडियो If you have liked the video then don't forget to like share comment and subscribe this channel see you in the next video bye bye till that time have a nice day